Okay, so we're on the part four challenge problems. Um, so for all of these, they deal with mixed numbers, and I know we haven't talked about mixed numbers, so it's okay if you don't feel confident um, doing it. But in order to multiply a mixed number by another mixed number or even by a whole number, you have to convert that mixed number to, a to an improper fraction. So in order to take one and five sixths to an improper fraction, there's a trick where you multiply the denominator by the whole number. So one times six is six. And then you add it to the top. So six plus of that fraction. So just the top of that fraction. That's 11. And then you put that number over the original denominator, 11 over six. So multiply by the denominator, add it to the numerator, put it over the denominator. And then the other one, four and one half, it's four times two, right? That's eight. We add one, because that's, um, so this is eight plus one, equals nine, and then this becomes nine over two. So then we're multiplying 11 over six times nine over two, which you can do from here. Um, same thing, so we're gonna put 15 over one, we'll leave that for now, and then three and one third, so we multiply three times three, right? Denominator times the whole number part of it. That's nine. And then we add one is 10. And we put that number back over the denominator. So this becomes 15 over one times 10 over three. One more of these, and then I'll let you try them on your own. So we got six and three tenths, okay? So it's six times 10 equals 60 and you add three, so it's 63 over 10 times 11 over one. So remember, you multiply the, uh, for the whole number, or for the mixed number, you multiply the denominator times the whole number, add the numerator, put it over the denominator, okay? And then that's how you do it. So if you need more help on that, I will try to attach a video up right here in this section before I assign it that goes over how to convert a mixed number into an improper fraction and then you can multiply. And then down here in this section um, you've got a lot of different problems um, that you can try um, pick and choose and then just write underneath the answers. Um, I'd suggest trying the negative ones and then the ones that have the parentheses this is just telling you to multiply. So if there's no other symbol or um, operation in the parentheses, um, you just multiply. This negative is a negative, not subtraction. So I might post another video explaining some of these, um, but it won't probably be today. So good luck.